हेलो माय डियर किड्स वी सॉ सच अ ब्यूटीफुल स्टोरी ऑफ दगड़ू वन डिसअपॉइंटेड चाइल्ड अ सैड चाइल्ड हु वाज सो मच डीपली मोटिवेटेड बाय हिज टीचर दैट ही रैन विथ कॉन्फिडेंस मेकिंग द होल स्कूल हिज फैन व्हाट एग्जैक्टली डज दिस स्टोरी टीच अस फर्स्ट थिंग इट टीचेज ऑल ऑफ अस दैट ऑन आर रिएक्शन ओनली डिपेंड्स इफ वी विल विन और लूज Kids used to tease Dagru by calling him Dagru. Irritated or not irritated was Dagru's reaction on it. Till the time Dagru was reacting on it, he was losing the game. As soon as he changed his reaction on it, as soon as he changed his action for not getting irritated if someone is teasing, the reason someone teases is that he want us to react and the moment we react he wins the game and as you stop reacting from that time you win and the one teasing loses the game please remember this always it totally depends on our reaction if we win or lose the reason dagru won was because he was able to control his reaction he didn't react second thing which is most important is that now dagru recognized his powers Now he came to know that he is a good runner. It is not important that every child is good in mathematics or the child is good in English. Some kids are good in games only. Some kids are good in music. Some are good in acting and theatres. Some are very good in dance performance. Some kids are very good in drawing. We should understand. that what we are good at and with which we can excel in life and passionately we should keep doing that thing as soon as we understand the hidden potential and powers in us we start winning that very moment so it is important that you people need to understand your potential to have lots of friends and leading those friends is also leadership quality that to show intelligence so don't think that i am not good in mathematics so i am a useless person it is important to understand what we are good at and the third very important thing that we learned was that there was one good teacher with whom dagru shared his feelings now it's not important that the person should be a teacher only it is possible she can be your mother he can be your father he can be your good friend your elder brother your uncle or your auntie there should at least be one person in this world with whom we can share everything and he should be our beneficial guide when such a person comes in our life then definitely they boost our confidence but you should share things without filters with them because the fourth very important thing to know is that the truth enhances our confidence i will now share a small story there was a boy who studied a lot and when he went to appear for his examination he thought that i don't know the answer of one question i will make a chit and hide it in my pocket will copy and write it but when he took that chit inside the examination hall his conscience was pricking that whatever i am going to do is something very wrong if this chit in my pocket gets discovered what will happen to me and because of this lie he was not able to answer the question he knew as well truth enriches our self confidence and the most important thing is that truth should be with our hard work whatever you are good at you should work so hard on it that you must be awarded for that and the moment we are awarded for something this whole world starts appreciating us for the same success is a challenge accept it see what way you lacking at and improve yourself at that till you are crowned with success banish sleep from your eyes and do not desert and run away from this land of defeat for without doing hard work no success comes and those who try very hard are never defeated thank you